This environment, I guess, is in, uh, isn't where we want to be at this particular moment. Brendan and Piper finally faced the music and made their paradise exit. Hey guys, we are back with another Bachelor Nation update. We have all the details on everyone who left Paradise last night. But before we get into it, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. So last night, Brendan and Piper voluntarily left Paradise after being confronted by the beach and once again discussing being there for Instagram followers. Joe and Demi led the charge with Natasha, Jasenia, Marissa, and Deandra to confront Brendan and Piper once and for all about them being in a relationship before arriving in paradise. Things got hostile pretty quickly and Brendan and Piper remained defiant that they did nothing wrong. Brendan actually got up and stormed away from what he described as Joe and his mob of disgruntled females. He also said, quote, if Natasha wants to talk for the 17th time about the relationship that we had, we can talk some more. But I think it's just a pathetic attempt to intimidate me. He and Piper privately discussed their influencing goals once again in the midst of all the chaos. Being there to further their careers wasn't something they seemed concerned with hiding. Piper said she was, quote, excited for the future possibility of making more money, but continued to explain she knew she could get there on her own, saying, quote, I have an entire master's degree in marketing. I think I can figure out how to get a few more more followers. Before leaving the beach, we did hear Piper tell Brendan, quote, I told you I didn't want to come. I told you. So if that's not confirmation that some sort of pre-paradise plan had been discussed, I'm really not sure what is. Seeing as Brendan has already lost about 100,000 followers, Piper attempted to do some damage control last night while the episode was airing. She posted on her Instagram story, quote, as my time in paradise concludes, I would like to clear up one final point of contention. Amidst everything that's been happening on and off screen, Brendan and I were not in an exclusive relationship in any capacity before filming. Exclusive or not, their pre-paradise relationship certainly crossed the line and thankfully justice for Natasha was served. Wells stepped in at the rose ceremony with a special rose just for Natasha to offer her a second chance at finding love in paradise. Of course, at that same rose ceremony, four girls did have to go home and we said goodbye to Jasenia, Demi, Deandra, and Tammy, who had probably the worst birthday ever after being dumped by Thomas and then swiftly kicked off the beach. You guys, the chaos will continue in paradise next Tuesday. We're gonna be having more new arrivals and of course, more drama, so get excited. In the meantime, we wanna know your thoughts on everything that happened in last night's episode. Do you think Brendan and Piper got what they deserved and who were you sad to see go? Let us know down in the comments. And if you are not already subscribed to our channel, make sure you do, make sure you ring the bell so you don't miss out on any future updates. As always, I'm your host, Fiona Zaring. You can check out my socials at Fiona Zaring and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.